Okay, listen, you're gonna love what I'm gonna show you today. The study's come a long way, and I wanna show the wine stuff, so follow me in. It's a great day here. We're just getting ready to get the uh, front elevation going, and I'm telling you, this project is coming over. Guys, how are you doing? Well, how are you? Well, what you're gonna love, I'm gonna show you for starters, is take a look at what you're gonna see behind you. Tony has just finished the pilasters. Now, do you remember our song about how we actually kicked out the plaster molding to create this room for these pilasters? They're done, they're finished. So there's the finished product on one side. The cool part for you is, if you look on the right, there's Tony in the different stages. He's been up and down. Tony, how many times have you been down today? A lot. A lot. He says, way too much, but take a look. So come along. I want you to see this, because now this is actually progressing a little bit more. We've got our casings up, we've got all our picture frames in here. Of course, I've shown you the uh, pillow ceilings, but once again, look how good they look. But, the reason for today, come on in. Take a look at my study. Look how well this is coming together. It has shaped up beautifully. And the last time I was here showing you the video, we were just at the stages of actually putting the stain on the top ceiling piece. Now you're starting to see the details, the accents. More importantly, the wood grain coming out. This is starting to come together. But more importantly, the last time I was here, I was showing you how these are actual doors and windows. Take a look at this now. Look how pretty this is set up. Now you've got your choice. It can either be sunshine or you've got the option to create a power room. I thought you'd love it. So we've got probably in here another, uh, for sure, seven or eight weeks. That'll take us to the final stage of putting in the beautiful French polish and finishing it all up. But now, come on. What's so exciting about today is we've moved on a little bit further in the wine cellar downstairs. I want you to come see this because this wine cellar, I'm telling you, is unlike any wine cellar you've seen before. The curves, the uh, details, the whole layout looks fantastic. Now, on a footnote, you've seen all the, all the panelings complete on the main stair. We're now actually starting it down the uh, second main stair in the basement. So come on, let's go see the basement. You'll love how this is coming together. And the purpose of the way we design the staircase is A, it's super structurally hard for all those beautiful uh, pieces of marble that's going to go down here. But second of all, it's wide enough that two of you can walk out. But you come down here into this main area and take a look. There you go. You've got your wine so Look at the gorgeous marble floor down here. You also see the two pound insulation that actually seals in all the cooling. So this wine cellar will be super, super cold or should say exactly the temperature you want it. And of course we've got the speakers lights, but here it is. There's your entrance into the wine cellar and take a look at this. So these two pieces are sitting at the front here and all this goes back towards you. This back wall you see here is the back wall in the distance. And of course, that's the door that leads into the cold room. But take a look at the designs. What I love is, look at the arches all the way around here. Look at all the different wine box holders inside here and look at all the details around the tops of this. Not only that, over in the corner here, we've got a gorgeous, sink and a bar uh, sink that will look fantastic with all the moldings around it. I'm telling you, when this wine cellar starts to get assembled, you're not going to believe it. See you soon.